Today is Labor Day, but it also marks the end of federal employment benefits, unemployment benefits that have been in place since March of 2020. But for some Kentuckians, there's a bigger issue. As LEX 18's Mike Valenti explains, many are still waiting on benefits they should have gotten over a year ago. That's tonight's Big Story at 11. Lynn Harding feels like she's been ghosted by state government. Even if they told me, look, you're not getting anything, just tell me in the saga. Break up with me if you need to. Harding filed for unemployment in August of 2020. She says she hasn't gotten a penny of the $17,000 she's owed. I've emailed countless representatives. I've reached out to UI assistance. I've reached out to UI benefits. I've reached out to the appeals branch. Even if I didn't get the federal, just the state that they owe me is $8,000. Since the start of the pandemic, we've heard story after story of people struggling to navigate a system that the governor has admitted was not equipped to handle this much demand. And as summer rolls into fall, challenges have dragged on, with some growing more complex. I had some money saved up and it's all completely gone. And now with this diagnosis, like it came out of nowhere. Now I'm just in limbo and I don't have any answers. It's been so frustrating for a year, a year. Of course, Harding still wants her money. Although the federal unemployment benefits have expired, based on our research, we found that Kentuckians should still be able to get retroactive unemployment benefits. If they're able to get someone on the phone. Mike Valenti, LEX 18 News.